Hi, this is Marcy of Earth Sky. The planet Venus is super bright in the eastern morning sky now. You can't miss it. In fact, Venus will be at its greatest brilliancy in the morning sky for 2025 on April 27th. It'll be super bright around then. Earth and Venus are constantly moving in their orbits around the sun, and Venus moves in a faster and smaller orbit than Earth. Right now, Venus is racing away from its inferior conjunction when it passed between the sun and Earth on March 22nd, 23rd. So right now, its disk size is decreasing and its phase is increasing. And Venus also goes through phases like our moon. So greatest brilliancy for Venus is a combination of two factors, illumination and disk size. When we see Venus as a crescent, it's close enough to us to exhibit its greatest illuminated extent. That's when its daytime side covers the greatest area of sky. So Venus is brighter around now than at any other time during its approximate seven-month reign in the morning sky. But remember, Venus is our brightest planet and outshines all other planets and stars. It just won't be as bright as it is around now. Although they aren't as obvious as Venus, there are two other planets near Venus in the morning sky. Saturn is near Venus and Mercury is low on the horizon. Look for the three planets about 30 to 40 minutes before sunrise. The moon is always helpful in locating stars and planets. On the morning of April 24th, look for a waning crescent moon near Venus, Saturn, and Mercury. Saturn and Mercury will be difficult to spot in the morning twilight. Then on the morning of April 25th, the moon will be between the trio of morning planets. Look about 30 minutes before sunrise. Venus will be visible in the morning sky through November. Then it won't be visible as it races toward its superior conjunction when it passes between the sun in early 2026. Then in March 2026, we'll see Venus again, now on the other side of the sun in the west after sunset.